Hello and good day. It is your girl Esther Joy coming at you with another video. On this channel, we love to talk about love, light, joy, and peace. So if you, my friend, are spreading these good vibrations to the planet, then hit subscribe, join the Good Vibes Delivery family. Thank you. Today, we are going to be talking a little bit about unconditional love. So, long story short, yesterday, my car got broken into. I went in there, papers were everywhere, it, everything was like in shambles, and I was like, all right. Unfortunately, they did not take the recyclable bottles out from the back, which I feel like would have been a smart idea if they were looking for money. Thank God I'm a broke college student that doesn't have any money. Anyways, I'm so thankful that, you know, everything was fine, the car works fine. Um, I'm so thankful for that. But how I felt when that happened, at first I was like, hmm, okay. Then I felt like, why, you know, why did this happen to me? Then I thought, Oh, I'm gonna like get back at that person like oh I'm so angry like I'm so hurt that someone would go out of their way to do that you know to go to my car that was parked in front of my house and go look for something anything in it so I felt hurt I felt hurt I kind of felt betrayed and I at first I was thinking like, oh, like, oh, they messed with the wrong person, <laughs> right? Um, I was like thinking to myself, I was like, what should I do about this situation? And I was like, I should, you know, wish unto them what they have done unto me. And I thought about that for a moment as I walked back inside. And, um, I was thinking about it and I couldn't bring myself to wish that upon them. I couldn't bring myself to wish their car, if they have a car, to get broken in or where they think their security to be lost because I already felt like that had happened for them and that's why they felt like it was okay to do that to others. So I didn't feel like wishing this upon them was going to help anything. Instead, I asked for forgiveness. I said, I'm sorry, I love you. Please forgive me. Thank you. And I let any thoughts of vengeance or anger, I let them go. I knew that those are not going to help me. Um, they're not going to help them either. Certainly, it's not something I want to have in my mind. It's not something that I want to have around me in my thoughts. It's not something I want to hold on to at all. So I let it go. As I was driving, I just felt just so compelled to sing. And I started singing a song of healing for them in their lives. I just felt, you know, the pain that they may have been going through in their lives that would cause them to do such a thing. And I just prayed and I just sang a song of healing that they would be cleansed and that the light would be shown unto them. I knew in my heart that this happened so that it could be healed. I knew that I am here in this earth to be a vessel of unconditional love and non-judgment. So when this happened, at first I was like, what should I do? And deep inside I knew what I had to do. I had to wish this person well. I had to bless this person in love, in unconditional love. Not because anyone was making me, but because for me, that is what I feel like my purpose is here. Anyone I meet, anyone I see or don't see, even in the darkness, I send them love. I send them unconditional love and faith that their life is exactly where it needs to be and all is going according to the plan. Whether you want to say it's God's plan, whether you want to say it's 
an individual, everyone has their own plan. You know, you both are right, everything it is it's all true. To me though, this this whole situation just brought so much awareness to myself about how how unconditionally loving and how non-judgmental I have really transformed. See, if that happened to me a year, two years ago, fuck a bitch up, you know what I'm saying? I'd be like, where they at? Like, we about to go somewhere, we about to fight, you know? And I think ultimately this happened for me to experience and realize how far along I've come in my own journey. That I am able to see someone that has done me wrong in some way, if I want to call it that, and show unconditional love and mercy and gratitude for their existence, knowing that this is all part of the bigger picture. This is all part of the plan. So, yeah, that is, <laughs> that is my message for today. Know that it is easier to forgive because in forgiveness you have that freedom to truly let go of anything that was holding you down low and when you forgive you are not only helping that other person ultimately you are helping yourself you are helping yourself release anything knowing that if you hold on to it it is only going to harm you if I kept that into my heart and I kept, oh, why did this have to happen to me? Oh, why, you know, why are there bad, shady people? Oh, I'm going to be really paranoid in my neighborhood now because there's someone around that's doing this. If I kept that in my heart, do you really think that's going to help me in any way? No. Sometimes it's harder to forgive people that have wronged us. But it is at those times that it is most important for us to forgive them. If not for them, then for us. We are here to be unconditional loving vessels. We are here to shine the love and the light of the one true creator. Regardless of what other people may be doing, drop judgment. It's not needed anymore. Love all beings because you are truly loved. That is my whole spiel. If you liked this video, if it resonated with you, hit that like button. Of course, if you have any comments that you would like to say below, any um, occurrences that have happened in your own life that um, you have forgiven and shown love to, then comment them down below. I would love to know. I love connecting to you guys that way. And of course, if you have not already subscribed, hit that subscribe down below. I love all my subscribers and I am so very thankful for you guys. As always, have a peaceful, beautiful day. Show unconditional love to all beings. Because truly, that is our core essence. Much love. Namaste.